Buzz that on that beat, ho. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. All right, different. guys. Just got my first uh, fish here. I got a new little setup I'm trying uh, that I learned from uh, some of our friends out in Texas, Oklahoma. It's basically a drop shot and it's got a flexit spoon uh, down there on the, uh, the bottom here. So the flexit and then a drop shot, the little three inch worm or three inch uh, minnow, catch you a nice fat spotted bass there. So it's a pretty one. Throw them back. Hey guys, watch my hand here as I, I kind of bounce the uh, rod in my hand, creating that uh, drop shot minnow to, to move around a little bit and give a little action. This is a great way to take a break from the yo-yo uh, method that you use with the spoon. Uh, and so you can kind of toggle back and forth uh, based on, you know, whatever action you feel like the fish are gravitating to, but it certainly worked for me here. Yes, sir. That's like playing the video games right there. Just sat there. This one. We've got the spoon. Yeah. Right there. Ooh. Look at all those funguses on him. Ooh. Pretty rough there, bud. Basically, I'm fishing right now on a very long um, underwater point. It comes out from back there, or over here, comes all the way through here. Oh, shoot, where'd they go? Ah, damn it. There we go. I'm on again. This time, got on the spoon. The old flex it. Got him. See there, fat spotted. There, guys, check it out. Pretty fish. Pretty fish. Ooh, stuck a big one right there. Yes. Got him on the spoon. The old flex it spoon guys. Man, he thumped it. Love that spoon bite. Man. Doggy. Dog. Love it. I'm using just basically a single one uh, octopus. Buzz that on that beat, ho. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. I'm different, yeah, I'm different. I'm... Hey guys, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed that short video. I filmed that yesterday out on Lake Lanier, December 30th. And uh, had gone out there just for a few hours to uh, try to chase some stripers, um, you know, with artificials. But unfortunately, it was afternoon and it was sunny, very windy. Uh, not very good conditions for... Uh, striper fishing with artificials. Uh, typically I look for overcast days when it's cloudy and those uh, fish tend to gravitate more towards the surface. Um, so I had a backup backup plan in place which was to uh, you know give that technique a shot and uh, had learned that from um, people out in Texas and Oklahoma chasing striped bass, hybrid, and um, white bass, you know catching them using that technique. So I wanted to give it a shot 
and uh, only really spent about uh, the last hour I was out there uh, fishing using that technique and uh, it did pretty well as you could see I really enjoyed it certainly would use it again so uh, hope you guys like it try to get some more videos out here soon uh, happy new year and uh, please like and subscribe. I'm different yeah I'm different I'm different yeah I'm different